there. Is this woman that is talking here with me? She lost her mother. She decided to fight every important men and women in her community to grace this occasion. She's not, she's not too young to lose her mother. Either she's not too old to lose her mother. But God give it and the same God take it. So on this note, I will put her hands together for my man Nelly. She don't cry or I don't sleep. I don't sleep. But I clap for her. They're not the claps, eh? Oh, they're not the claps. So, what I will ask the families to do in the next two, three minutes, just gather yourselves and thank everybody. Madam.
someone that is always faithful. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let everybody shout a bigger hallelujah. God bless you all. Everybody say amen, please. Although I'm not a pastor, but if I pray, say amen and the blessings go with you forever and ever. Thank you. Um, we don't intend to waste very much time. We are going to begin with the program of the day. The first is the official introduction of the person that will mastermind this ceremony today. There's not a person, but my honorable self, Professor Victor Osahini Obudu, born in Via Pokeria, Bini City. Please put your hands together for Professor. I will say that, ladies and gentlemen, who want to recognize officially various groups that are well represented here today. First, we are going to jam our hands together. I should say thank you for coming to all members of Edo State Community Campaign Region. All Edo, Edo Community. In this evening, let me inform all those sons and daughters that the road to be member, to be a member of a State Committee is wide open. If you follow the rules, we equally have the Yoruba ladies. Yoruba ladies. Are they the same? Where are they sitting at this? The Yoruba ladies. Ah, uh -huh. are they ladies? No, I'm going to clap for them. Yoruba ladies. You are welcome. God bless you all. In that same vein, we, we equally put our hands together to say thank you for coming to members of Success Ladies Club. Success Ladies, where are they? Success. Please, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for members of Gospel Life Worship Center. You are welcome. And uh, equally, let me ask us to equally join my hands together for uh, the people from Castle Motuno, uh, Kasani, and uh, we don't know what why, not even here in Italy, no, I'm from Nigeria, even to Australia and New Zealand. Ladies and gentlemen, can we join my hands together? As we applaud the presence of Dr. Sunshine Morokuma, the Oyama of the Kingdom, Norma Yamu, one of the United Nations, Tubana, Wapo Kao, Tunis, where did they cook soup? Well represented here, Kojo, Kojo and friends. Please, can we put our hands together for Kojo and friends? And this say, and yeah, talk about See, our mommy has passed away. Late Madame Florence Ima Gomaro Okoro was born on the 12th of February 1947 into the family of Mr. and Mrs. Olomu, a Thai self from a warlock man community in a Vietnam local government area of Edo State, Nigeria. She was the only surviving female child among five children. Late Madame Florence Okoro attained her primary education in St. Peter's Primary School. She was very brilliant but could not proceed to study further due to some unavoidable circumstances. <laughs> Beyond her reasonable control, she later learned fashion and designing and became a famous tailor. 
she was a very brave woman. She always stood by the truth and was a friendly personality to whoever comes her way. She got married in December 1967 to Mr. Abumere Obase, a Nigerian police, and was blessed with three children, but later lost one, and she was a devoted Christian who kept the faith till the end. Her commitment, dedication, and readiness to follow biblical injunctions led to her baptism in the year 2004. Mama, Mama earlier marriage was legally dissolved in 1978 and Mr. Adams in Nebo, an educational administrator, remarried her in 1981 according to tradition and was blessed with a son. Mama was an industrious woman capable of turning anything into wealth. She was a successful and astute trader. Mama was variously described as warm, generous, a citadel of mor moral rectitude, and above all, a strong disciplinary. Suffice it to say that what stood Mama out amongst her contemporaries was her strong faith in Christ Jesus. She passed on on the 16th of June 2019 after a prolonged illness. Mama, we, we your children are proud and deeply grateful to the Lord Almighty for having you as our mother. The virgins you permitted to us is what God is using to see us to the ups and downs of this life. We rejoice knowing that you are enjoying peace in the shadow of the Almighty, and gentle soul to him to rest and rest and rest in the Lord in Jesus' name. And now, we are going to do the opening dance. Dr. Sunshine, please move to your arena. Dr. Sunshine and Co., please move to your arena. Love one, two, two. Love 
I'm 